Okay guys, I have upgraded to 1.7. Right, now let's think about this. Um, where to start? Do these place on this table? They do not, so. <laughs> Lead ingots still do not place on tables. That's not an issue or a problem. Let's have a look at this. Now we're gonna to have to do cooking and a friend of mine, Rastrick, has suggested that I should extend this whole area. And I think what I'm going to do is, I'm gonna ruin that view if I extend that way, aren't I? I do like that view. Let me have a think about this. I may have to alter the way this whole thing's built. Um, which, seeing as it was built on a mud pile for defence, is not surprising. Do I like the view there? That view is not so good, and I do have... So if I were to extend it, I could extend that corner there and leave that one as it is. So I would still get the beautiful view this way. We would lose... We've still got the view this way but we would lose this window. I don't think that's a bad, um, I mean, that's quite cramped anyway, because I put the stairs here. So I think that's the way we will go, guys. We're going to extend out this way. Ha ha. Now, to do that, let's just have a look from over here. Yeah. I think my kitchen area is going to come out here. And then we'll come on to this bit. The question is how far should it come out? Do we leave that there or do we... No, I think we take the kitchen through here with the stairs going up. So I think we are going to do quite a lot of building there. Okay, guys. Rastrick, my friend, you have set me on a task here. Uh, that's not what I want. I want... I got some planks. Right. Now, I believe that that makes a large trough and this makes a small trough. Now, what is the difference between a large trough and a small trough? What is that? Oh, look, the stone has changed. It has changed. And what's more, most of my stone's gone. <laughs> Okay. <laughs> All right. <laughs> All right, let's have a look at, let's come to E. Let's have a look at this. Material wood, burn temperature, burn duration. All right, so I know that it will burn. Now I believe, have I still got grain? I have, oh thank goodness for that. Flax, spelt, rye, I've got a lot of rye. Oh, look at this. Look at the bread. Look at this, guys. Wow. Now, I believe that if I can make a bucket, I can pour my honey. Honestly, there is so much to explore. I need more planks for a bucket. Um, I just don't know where to start. Right, what are these planks? Oak. All right, let's see if we can get a bucket. We can. All right, now that's an empty bucket. We've got troughs. We'll come back to what we can put in those in a moment. Wow. <laughs> now, if I put that bucket down, all right, I've got seven bowls of honey on me. That color has changed. Can I? Wow. Am I eating those? That's got one litre of honey. Do I have to... 1.25 litres of honey. Not sure what I did there. I have a honey bucket and guys, that is... That is just... Um, really bad. <laughs> 
it's an old-fashioned English term for a bucket of uh, urine and it comes from the days when they used to take the chamber pots down from the houses they used to call it a honey bucket oh my goodness I wish I hadn't even started on that one but it's a hard term to use for me <laughs> right now I don't know whether the troughs get filled with straw blocks or straw let's try it let's try it so let's come over here some straw blocks okay and let's go and put some troughs out in the hope that we can attract some animals now I don't have any animals anywhere near here so I may have to uh, do what I saw to Asgard do it's just do you just right click no right right click it's not placing it shift right click it's not placing it huh okay small trough that will place so it's just it's the big one that won't place why won't the big one place well let's look at the little one let's let's make the most of what we've got and not grieve about what we haven't got i tell you what getting used to the look of this is going to be quite something those are both shell stone let's get those together so do we put no do we put bail that's not going to work is it i'm not being too successful at this so far guys right small trough can you put you can't put grass in a small trough okay well this is not the animal husbandry update though we do have animal husbandry this is actually the other update so why can't i place a trough does it have to be placed on stone? Let's have a look. Will it place here? Ah! And presumably it's made of wood. So if I take that trough... Oh my goodness, have I got any cobblestone? I have, thank goodness for that. Let's go and have a look. So the trough, the, the small trough will place on grass. Uh, but the big trough it's a bit naff there right let's have a look at this so that will place on grass but the big trough I think we may have to oh goodness let's have a look at this let's put some stone cobblestone down it would make sense actually because it would stop it rotting maybe it's the direction you put it from maybe it's like a bed it's like a bed okay you do not have to put cobblestone down guys it the placing of it i think we would all almost instinctively want Ooh, that's a different sound did you hear that it sounds much higher not quite so deep the deep throated mining sound has gone okay so if i want yeah it's like a bed just remember that guys <laughs> all these things are sent to try us so and presumably you have to take that off so we want it to attract animals let's uh right all right now can i put bales of straw no not like that so can i put bales of straw like that no do you put raw straw let's get them on the bar again okay let's try this oh it's raw straw it's raw straw guts <laughs> 
you've probably gathered that okay and rye it's just that wonderful let's put some light on the scene doesn't that look great guys so you don't even have to make it into bales though bales would look good it's raw straw i love it and this is the it's just the the rye you don't have to make that into flour so hopefully that would feed any animals that might come around not that there's any animals in this area at all apart from the drifters Actually, let's hold our torch in our hand while we go past here we don't want to fall into my mind do we right oh damn now i know that we've got cabbage that has to be found in a ruin Gosh, this is exciting, guys. Okay. <laughs> I'll come back to you when it's daylight. One final word on troughs, guys. I've done an experiment and I found out that you can put rye in the large trough, but I can't put hay, the, uh, not hay, the uh, dry grass in the small trough. So as far as I'm aware, the small trough will only take grain. The large trough will take either. Now to get the rye out of the large trough, I had to break it. So I'm not going to break it again. So I've now got two enclosures and they've both got straw and grain in them. I don't know whether, I mean, there are just no animals in this area at all. So I don't think we will attract anything but at least I've worked out how the troughs work and I absolutely love them. I think they're beautiful, very, very beautiful. So guys, troughs, we've learned a bit about those today. Bye bye.